Hey Energy fans, your guys in green finally back on the pitch. Oklahoma City coming off one of the longest layoffs in club history facing the Swope Park Rangers, the new kids on the block in the USL, if you will. The kids from KC playing very well coming into this game, 2-0-1, tied for second in the USL West. Oklahoma City looking for their first victory. A whole lot of familiar faces tonight for Kansas City. Duke, Van Kompernal, Kempen, all on the other side this time. In goal for Oklahoma City tonight, C.J. Cochran in place of Cody Lorendi. Lorendi still trying to recover from the flu. Starts off in the 18th minute, Oklahoma City with chances. The center, Busco can't get it. Coy Kraft hits the post. No goal, no score. Skip ahead to the 25th minute. Swope Park with their chances. This one sails just high. C.J. strong in goal for Oklahoma City in the first half. 44th minute, Kunick. To Coy Craft curls just wide, scoreless at the break. Pick up in the 54th minute, second half, off the free kick. Chiva Cuevas, Kimpen, the great save, the former Oklahoma City energy goalkeeper, an unbelievable game. 66th minute, Kimpen again, the save off Koenig. 70th minute, Swope Park with a chance to get on the board, just high by Oliveira. CJ, a clean sheet and goal for Oklahoma City tonight. Um, I mean, our goal is to get a shutout, and we did that. And I think if you look at the stats, you can see that really Sip and Cody and Kalen and, uh, and, and MT really, really did all the work. You know, if you look at the stats, I really didn't have much to do. I kind of prefer it that way. CJ had a rock solid performance. He was there when, when needed. Uh, not a lot of action. It's not always easy to be a goalkeeper when there's not a lot to do, but he was there when, when needed, so rock solid performance. The game winner comes in the 78th. Sebastian Dalgard to defender Kalen Ryden. The big man from Norman gets it to go with his head. 1 0 Oklahoma City. You know, uh, I think the ball came in from one of the center backs, can't remember. I took a touch inside, played the ball all the way out to Sebi. And I knew Seb was going to get the ball in the box, so I just continued my run, got on the, uh, on the back post, and he played a ball right to my head and found the back of the net. The, 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 new, the new outside back, you know, nowadays gets forward a lot, and so that's kind of expected of me and MT to get, you know, assists and goals this, this year. So, but yeah, it felt nice to get my first of the season, first of the energy. Um, so, yeah, let's move forward and, and give many more of these. And that's how this one would end. OKC gets the victory. It's their first three points of the season. They now have four on the year. They're feeling good going into their next road game. I'm very happy for, for the team that got the win. You know, it's been a little bittersweet feeling. We played so well and only would stood here with a, with a point. Uh, very, very excited for, for the guys. And, and that momentum from, from this game here has got to carry on. Yeah. We're really pushing for this game. Haven't got a win so far. Only, only team in the, in the USL without a win, I believe. And until now, we just got our win. So really, really proud of that. You know, can't, can't ask for anything more than a win and a shutout. We went loss, tie, win, so you can see the progression is getting better, so we're just going to try to keep that moving forward. So Oklahoma City does get that victory. Hopefully they can establish that rhythm they've been looking for. Next up, on the road, Seattle. That'll be on Sunday. Oklahoma City looking for their first road game and their first road victory of the year. If you want tickets to the next home game, you can always give us a call, 235-KICK. Also, go to energyfc.com for upcoming games and upcoming events. And also stay with us this week for a huge announcement that you won't want to miss. For Energy FC TV, I'm Brent Skarkey.